Hey Jacob, so at MetaConnect yesterday, they came out with some really big news regarding Ray-Ban Meta and also Orion, um, but we'll talk about that another time today. Let's talk about Ray-Ban Meta. Um, they came out with some new features with an enhanced AI and translation and environmental recognition. Mm -hmm. What can you tell me about these new features coming to light? Yeah, this was a really exciting announcement. Uh, this is the race for the face is definitely on and Meta's taking a nice lead. Uh, they're certainly in the pole position. Uh, the the new features, the uh, the AI, the environmental, the uh, translation, the real-time translation, all of these are really cool things. And what it really means to us here at New Current and within our specialty is that power consumption is continuing to go up in glasses. Uh, the more processing that you need to do in order to do things like uh, the memory that the AI will have or will remember things like GPS locations. Where did you park your car? So you can just say, hey, Meta, where did I park my car? And all the directions. It's, it, it's, it is amazing and it's super enhancing. And I'm really excited and proud of Meta for doing this and planting this flag in the race for the face. Uh, but it really does mean they need to be excellent with power management because you don't want the battery to die in two hours or four Absolutely. hours. Absolutely. Yeah, how are we going to use all these features if your battery keeps dying? Absolutely. And then, so you want a really efficient power management. Mm -hmm. You want higher capacity uh, power storage, so the batteries. And then you also have to have seamless ways of charging these things. So on the go, um, also on your nightstand, also at work, and you want that charging to happen really quickly. Yeah. Ultimately, the best thing would be if we didn't need batteries and these things could just have like, you know, unlimited power supplies, but that that's not a reality. And so within the reality of um, power being a scarce resource within these, you know, micro miniature devices, mm -hmm. you have to really squeeze out every last ounce of perfection. Um, you need the best technology and then you need to uh, be able to bring that to light. Yeah, you don't really have downtime to just let things sit for a long amount of times so when this is something that you're using daily by the minute, by the hour. That's absolutely true. And, you know, I've noticed a lot more, uh, you know, when I, I do wear Ray-Ban Vatas, I wear them as sunglasses. Okay. But there are a lot more people that are wearing them as their everyday glasses. And um, I know people love to be able to kind of like take videos or pictures of their kids without having to pull out their phone. But that means you kind of want them on your regular lenses or your transition lenses. So you're right. If they're your regular lenses, you don't really want to take them off for two hours of charge. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So really exciting announcement. Uh, power consumption is going to continue to go up. We saw this in the mobile phone space. They just keep adding more and more features. It makes it better and better. But power management is foundational to every set of smart glasses. And we're here to help customers with that. Absolutely. Thanks. Thanks. Anyway.